Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is another update for the 100 samples by 2017. I have finished off three more samples, so let's get into it. The first sample I finished was the apple juicy, the peach juicy smell. Um, honestly, I don't know if now it's just because it's summer, it's a little bit warmer out. Well, it's definitely warmer out. Um, a little more humid even. Um, this actually was really nice. I know the past ones I've been trying, I was kind of like, oh, they're not the greatest. They're not the best moisturizer. But, and you know what, if you do have dry skin or if it's winter where you are or just really dry, this might not be enough for you. But if you're somewhere where it's really warm, it's really humid, and you don't want a super heavy moisturizer throughout the day, this actually might be something you want to check out because it's super light. Um, it has pleasant fragrances. Uh, there's a wide range of fragrances um, so even if peach is not your thing I'm sure you can find something you like and it is just a really nice lightweight moisturizer not something I'd wear at night um, but just during the day it was quite pleasant then I also finished this Strevechin, the Intensive Concentrate for Wrinkles and Stretch Marks. I really can't attest for how it works for stretch marks nor wrinkles but what I can say is I actually saw results for this, um, which I don't normally see when I'm trying these anti-wrinkle creams. Um, not that I really expect a whole lot, because like I said, I, I don't really have what it's for. Um, but I actually saw results with this. Um, it's super thick, so I did mix in a little bit of my face oil with it just to make it sink into my skin a little bit easier. It does have like a spearmint fragrance, which I'm not a fan of, but I still enjoyed it. But what, more than anything, I really enjoyed was when I put it on, I could feel it tingling and working away at my skin. And when I woke up in the next morning, it was brighter, it looked more refreshed, it didn't look as dull. Um, so it really did do something for my skin, which I think says a lot considering it's just a little foil packet. Normally you don't see a whole lot of results because you're not really trying it out for an extended period of time. But just in the short time I was using this, I did see results with my skin, so it might be something worth checking out if you're in the market for a new night cream. Then I also finished off a perfume sample. This is the Givenchy Live Irresistible. Um, just a little foil packet. I hate foil packets because I was trying to like get it out and it would end up squirting like this way and that way. And it was just ugh, not the greatest. Um, but it was super, super feminine. Really nice for spring and summer. Um, had notes of like a fruity, floral, just really sweet feminine scent. Um, really light and easy to wear like at work. It wasn't overpowering. Really nice actually. I did write this down. I think this might be one I want to check out. My only thing is it does smell very similar to the Lancome La Vie Espel, which I already own. And so I don't know. I'll have to compare the two a little bit more and see if it is different enough to warrant getting it or if it's just like another perfume I like, which would make sense because if I already own a scent like it, I would like this as well. <laughs> so if you don't have anything like it, or if you really just like light, floral, fruity, sweet scents, um, maybe check this out. It was a pleasant surprise for me because I normally do like the more warm, darker, sensual scents. Uh, but yeah, so those are the three I finished off, so let's pick three more. And I'm not taking that one, two, and three. Okay, let's see what I got here. So I got uh, a Veen. What is this? Uh, relief Concentrate for Chronic Redness. Oh. Interesting. I don't know if you can see that. It's very faint writing. Um, okay, I'll try it out. And then I also got a Mary Kay cream lipstick. This is in Copper Star, which everyone is coming out with their metallic lipsticks right now, so right on trend, I guess. <laughs> um, and then I also got the Pantene Pro V Expert Collection for Dry Defy, and that's a shampoo and conditioner. So I'll give those a go, and I will let you know what I think of them. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Take care, guys.